Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Here we go. All eyes are on the undisputed UFC welterweight champion. Future might be in the UFC Hall of Fame, but he certainly didn't want to hear that noise in the fighter meeting. He is focused on the present, and that is this significant challenge against the number one contender tonight. Yeah, he's not looking down the line. This is the guy that lives in the here and now. He told us the other day, John, that he has so many more defenses to put himself alongside the great welterweight champions tomorrow in Usman and George St. Pierre. He has got a real idea of where he wants to go, and he feels like tonight is just another step in the road to great. And he's been inspired by all of those great welterweights that preceded him, Leon Edwards among them. Now it's his turn to shine out of his stage. Herb Dean, our referee for this one, just about to get underway. All right, here he is, the founding father of modern MMA, Bruce Lee, ready to go for round one. The speed and the angles, just absurd, and a heart got to simulate in training. You think you got a beat on him, and then you end up twitching on the canvas. So we'll see how the opponent chooses to defend Bruce Lee here in the early go. Big right hook there by the champ. Here comes the kick. That one blocked by Lee. Dig deep now. Good body shot in the end there. Nice shot there by the champ. Back kick there. The one two punch is true. Kick attempt, unable to find the target. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Fighter lands a kick to the leg now, and a pretty good one at that. Oh, misses with the jab. kick there to the body. Now he's got the single collar and the clinch. Just over three minutes to go in our first round. Oh, he's separates from the clinch. Let your hands go. Just lands a good series of kicks here. Swing and a miss by Lee. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Just out of range with that kick attempt. This worked. Leg kick. Nice body shot. Sidekick now. Relax, relax. Keep your hands up. Moving out. 
Just over two minutes to go. Able to land, but barely with that front kick. <laughs> Trying to go to the body here, unable to find the target. Out of range with that kick attempt. Oh, nice knee. Just turning his hip over into the leg kick. Just misses with the jab there. to go on our opening round. Both hey. fighters exchange in the pocket here. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He has certainly found his range on the feet. I mean, when you don't check, you're gonna continue to get blasted with kicks. His opponent has not deterred him from keeping on throwing those kicks. Oh, beautiful one-two punch. Good jab there by the champion. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. 20 seconds left. Oh, man. Oh, rips the body shot there. Oh. Round two straight ahead. Let us now check out some of the action, DC, and what a display of body striking there in that previous round. I mean, the last time I saw this done at this level was Valentina Shevchenko and Jessica I. Body kick, body kick, body kick. Eventually look for him to go over the top to try to end the fight. You ready to fight? You ready? Go All right, let's get to round two. All right, so here we go with our next round. DC, you are known for having one of the higher fight IQs in the game, and I would put him on that list after what we saw in terms of the body work there in the previous round. He did a fantastic job of mixing up his target, not headhunting, going to the body, making that investment into forcing a mistake later that will allow him to chase the finish. Useful strike there, the hook is clean. Oh, there's that patented leg kick. Clipped him with the right hand there. Oh, punches in bunches as he lands another combination there. Really doing a nice job stringing his shots. Together. He's doing a great job of stringing the shots together and also just mixing up the target and the attacks. Great job finding different places for his strikes to land. striking on point tonight and as evidence some swelling now on his opponent yeah light swelling right now but if he doesn't address it immediately it'll turn to something much worse well the left hook has been there at times not that time oh tags him with the straight nice job there by Lee. he's found his range now he's in a rhythm landing those nice beautiful punches well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. This pace is just absurd, and he has kept it up throughout the fight. Shades of Max Holloway against Calvin Cater, punches and bunches. I mean, being there, watching Max Holloway do what he did was super impressive. So to even list his performance alongside that tells you how this guy is fighting tonight. Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good. Oh, and a cut has just opened up on his forehead. We'll keep an eye on it. Oh, beautiful job to get the kick. 
strike home to the body. And again, right back to the well with the body. Keep your hands up. Need some work, guys. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Good knee. Flips. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment, John. It may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do eventually, it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Let's get busy with those hands now, man. Come on, let it go. Oh, back and forth to go. Ooh, looking to go to the leg kick here, just out of range. All right, so some definite damage underneath the elbow now on the side of his opponent. A lot of strikes to the body starting to starting to add up. Yeah, a lot of strikes to the body and mixing up the attack, not being one-dimensional, not headhunting inside the octagon. I, I think he has fought beautifully right now, and it's starting to show itself. Oh, nice kick. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. There it is, another strike to the body. That has been a big storyline in this fight. We'll keep an eye on it as the bout continues. You know, we'll keep an eye on it. But the person that should be addressing it is his opponent. His opponent isn't doing anything to deter him from doing this constantly. He has got to change something if he wants to fight this fight and win this fight. Big shot to the head. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Looks like someone took a red sharpie to his side. A lot of bruising courtesy of those body strikes. Oh, big kicks, big punches. He's doing everything he told us he intended to do to slow this guy down. And you can see his opponent starting to really be labored in most of his movements. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, that's the end of the round. You see the cut on his forehead sustained in that round. The cut man has 60 seconds now to close it up and try to prevent it from becoming an issue here moving forward. All right, well, one minute of end swell can only do so much. Let us look back at some of the damaging strikes in that previous round. It doesn't seem like it's going to do much. And if it does, he can't take any more of these shots. He was too stationary. He took everything square on the target. He's got to move his head, and he's got to be proactive instead of reactive in terms of his defenses. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. All right, next round is now underway. I thought there was pretty good back and forth action in the previous round. Yes, it wasn't a bar fight. It wasn't two guys going to kick the sink at each other. But you did see times where they came together and you saw the skill level of these two fighters. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Beautiful little hook. Sidekick lands for him there, champ. A lot of times that is used to manage space. Big punch lands for the middle. Big straight left. Trying to establish that jab once again. What a nasty kick. That was thrown with ill intent. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bears watching. That's going to hurt this opponent. Well, we may have the best cut men and women in the business.
business, but I'm not sure they're going to be able to do much with that cut. It continues to widen with every passing stroke. And you're fighting a great fighter. It's hard to deal with the damage of the cut while dealing with the level of the fighter in front of you. Right now, you've got to do something different to try and change the way that this fight is playing out. Just over three minutes to go. Nicely done with the kick there. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Work. Come on, nice work. body kick there. We pass the midpoint here of the fight. Gets it close and gets that single collar tie locked in tight. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. Oh, sidekick, well timed there. Oh, pinpoint strike lands there and not going to help the swelling upstairs. I love this accuracy, this ability to get his shots to the target right away. And you see it in the swelling that is forming on his opponent's face. Oh, brilliant execution to land the roundhouse. Nice combination by the champ. Lee going for the leg kick. Just to do it there. Nice level change with the line shot. Well, he has got to be thrilled with this effort here tonight. There was a lot of pressure on him coming in. He has doled out a lot of damage, landed a lot of strikes. Near flawless execution. Sometimes the hardest thing to do is what's expected. When you're expected to win, sometimes it's hard to live up to that expectation. He lived up to that expectation, and he exceeded it with such a great performance. Missed with that attempt. Back and forth we go. That was a hard body kick. One minute now to go in the third. Doing work with the jab there. Well, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. Straight right is there. Oh! Oh, he won it again, bro. Ooh. Nice leg kick. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. 15 seconds. Nice uppercut by the champion. That's three rounds. We're now headed to the championship round. All right, there's the horn. The round is over, but not before he was cut on his nose from the strikes in that round. Back to the stool. Cut man is in. Should be able to shut that cut and prevent it from becoming an issue moving forward. But, of course, as soon as he gets struck in that next round, it could open back up. All right, so a huge round for him there. Nearly had him out of there with the head kick. Did get the knockdown. Talk us through the replay. He got the knockdown. He won the round. He did everything correct. The only thing he didn't do is finish the fight. But if he continues down the path, if he continues to do the exact same thing as he did before, he will get that finish. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. Fourth round. Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. All right, so here we go. You can feel the tension. Fourth round is underway. We'll see who has the upper hand here. You feel it inside of the arena. The fighters feel it inside of the octagon. It's palpable. The energy is crazy because you understand that in the next 10 minutes, someone's going to get a belt strapped around their waist. It's amazing. Again, going back to the jab just out of range.
punch got blocked there. All right, don't waste your energy. Stay relaxed. Set it up a little bit better. Well, as we pull up the numbers there, bottom of your screen, the body strikes really tell the story in this one. That was a big focus for his camp coming in, and he has certainly worked that midsection to great effect here tonight. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Beautiful kick there. Yeah, he's got to. He's got to start checking kicks. Back and forth we go. <laughs> Throwing that low kick. He does everything so well. And he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spark. Well, this fight's been pretty crazy thus far. Both guys doling out a lot of damage and Neither seems too bothered by it, but clearly both parties are hurt. Both guys are hurt. Both guys are fighting beautifully. Both are showing a lot of heart right now in this fight. They're both doing amazing jobs. Let's see who gets the job done at the end of the day. Still plenty of time with which to work here round four. Oh, and he goes to the hook now. It's good. Man, that cut is so bad, you wonder if at some point that is going to start to affect his breathing. Nice job by the fighter here to continue to block the shots coming his way. You think he's trying to sort of fatigue his opponent here a little bit? He's kind of watching and seeing everything that's happening in front of him. Later, you'll see him start to throw counters after the shot. Looks like it did stun him a little bit. Lee's pass is denied. Hard to win MMA fights off of your back, but these strikes are useful from the bottom. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Well, his opponent seemed to be stunned to a significant extent, but was able to recover and it's almost like the whole Good fight here, under two to go. All right, so the ref is going to step in here and call on the doctor to look at what is a now mangled nose. This could be the end of the fight. It could be the end of the fight. There's a lot of blood. The blood's going down into the mouth. I mean, the nose could be broken. Well, if you like blood, this is the fight for you. Doesn't appear to be affecting his vision too badly right now. Looks as though he's going to let him play. Wow, he allows him to continue. Ready to fight. Very surprising. Ready. Fans are with it. All right, well, this fighter was bullish in his desire to continue, and the doctor is going to afford him that opportunity as the referee gets us back underway. This guy's a fighter, man. This guy doesn't want to lose a fight on the stool. He wants an opportunity to go out there and go out on the shield. And that's exactly what he's getting. He's getting a chance, and as a fighter, that's all you can ask for. And you know fans don't like doctor stoppages, so they are thrilled. They start booing. And sometimes guy's eye is hanging off the side uh -huh. of his head. Yeah, looks a little wobbly on his feet. Well, at this point, DC, I'm not sure if he's just buying his time or just trying to get some extra reps, but go finish the game. It seems like the guy's playing with his food. You know, he's having a good time out there. Everything's working. He's in the zone. It feels like at any moment he can end the night of his opponent. But he seems to be having fun. And hey, to each his own, I guess. I'd be rushing out of that octagon. Yeah, you don't play with your food. No. One minute to go in the round. Oh, man, that cut is getting worse by the minute. Looking ghastly at this point. All right, so as advertised thus far as these fighters continue to trade strikes. Head kick attempt. It's blocked. Oh, that jab alerted his opponent. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. 20 seconds now remain in the round. Oh, man, you got to credit him for continuing to attack that area, but that... Oh, yeah. right Not being just offensive, but offensive off of his back. Great punch lane. 20 minutes down, potentially five to go. All right, there's the end of the round, and hopefully not the end of the fight. He doesn't look as handsome as he did when he walked out. That is a severe gash on his face. 
All right, I'm being told we've got some replays from the previous round, and it appears as though the cut on the bridge of the nose is getting worse by the minute. It's getting worse by the minute, and he's got an opponent in front of him that wants to target it. He wants to hit him on the nose over and over again. I wonder if every time he gets hit there, the blood goes down into the mouth, making it difficult to breathe. You ready to fight? Ready. Fifth and final round. Oh, big hook. That'll sting. Well, you can feel that breeze octagon side after the swing and a miss by Lee. There's that side kick. Oh, an obvious limp there. His leg hurting for certain. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Good kick. Great punch, beautifully landed by the opposition. All right, so when is too much too much? I mean, I'm not sure I need to see this fighter absorb any further damage here. Tonight. It's okay if his corner or the ringside position calls a stop. He has been battered, he has been beaten, and the result is not going to change. Oh, sidekick, well done. Well, he landed a big... <laughs> Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Collar tie here in the clinch. Huge knee land. Well, oftentimes when you see damage like this, things are critical. We don't always see a referee calling a doctor for body strikes, but maybe this would be... Oh, he can't even stand. finish tonight absolutely gets it with style points a huge huge result here in this arena tonight it's always fun to see an athlete tell you what they're gonna do and then they do it this guy told us he was going to get a finish and that's exactly what he did him and his team are gonna have a fantastic time tonight celebrating they should all be very proud